it's Nana. I'm fine, yes, yes. Are you sitting straight? How's my little man? How's Travis? Have you been feeding him? He'll tell me if he's hungry, I'll know. I saw Tina, your Tina. Her and her new beau, her man, Thomas. I should have said before, my brains. He is such a gentleman. Pleased to meet you, heard so much about you. He's a chef at a top restaurant. Like a harvester, a four-star chef. What about you, Royston? When will you be a four-star anything? I'm afraid you were spoilt. Poisoned by artificial squashes, colours and flavourings, moonshine and monkey juice. It was blue juice. Blue! There's no goodness in blue juice. It poisoned your manners. I've just finished with my jo- Samuel. I wish. Oh, okay. Jo red tastes of red wine and white bread. For your grandpappy, eating was a chore. Even before his tumour consumed him, he would talk while he was eating. He would talk like talking was a preservative, more vinegar or formaldehyde. He passed on when he stopped to take a breath. I saw Tina. Tina says that she wants to come and collect some things, her cutlery and pillowcases. You don't need to be in, better if you're not. She has her key. Oh, Royston, you have lost something fine. I expect nothing of you and still you disappoint me. But I hope for a bright future for you. Poor Grandpappy, happy release. Goodbye.